911. Yes, I'm calling from the Hampton Inn in Waycross. Yes, sir. It sounds like there's been gunshots or something here. Tonight we're hearing for the first time the 911 calls made as a Jacksonville rapper was ambushed in Waycross during the weekend. One man was killed in that gunfire. Another was seriously hurt. On your side's Alex Asaitis has a closer listen all new tonight. Call after call, the moments right after a deadly shooting in Waycross describing a frantic scene. Where County 911. Yes, ma'am. There were, I don't know, 10 shots at least. Panic in the voice of a female caller. One of nearly a dozen made to the Ware County 911 Center in the moments right after the shooting. The first of the calls to come in just after 3.30 Sunday morning. A group of men, including rapper Young and Ace, were near the pool of the Hampton Inn when they were shot at, according to police. Uh, hi, uh, I just heard a bunch of uh, loud echoing pops sound a lot like gunshots. But it brought me out of a sound sleep. It was several rounds. Many telling dispatchers about the gunshots, but inside the hotel, a much more chaotic situation. Running through the halls, banging on everybody's door, running outside the building, around, banging on windows. Waycross police arresting three Jacksonville men in connection to the crime. Mark Isaac Jefferson, Leroy Gerard Whitaker, and Devontae DeMora Starks, all facing various charges, including possession of a firearm. Unclear the motive, but one piece that police continue to examine if others may be involved. They've come in the hotel, and I was looking out because I could hear them running. And five of them ran past our door, and they were screaming, we got to go, we got to go before the police get here. Still ahead at six, more of these calls, plus where this investigation stands right now. Reporting, Alex Osiris, First Coast News, on your side. Scary situation for those guests at that hotel. Alex, thank you.